My friends, life is too short to walk in bitterness. I've heard it said that bitterness is like drinking poison and hoping the person who wronged you dies. But really, really what bitterness does is it really hurts us. And that's why the Bible places such a premium on because we've been forgiven, we should forgive others. Now, that doesn't mean we should forget what happened. It doesn't mean we're condoning what they're doing. And it doesn't mean that we should pretend like it didn't happen. But really, bitterness, it becomes a root in our hearts that chokes out a lot of the other fruit that God wants to do. And I'm here to tell you, because we live in a broken world, we're surrounded by broken people, and we're broken people ourselves. Bitterness, is, it happens easy. Cynicism happens easy. I've seen all of these things in my own heart, in my own life. But I constantly find as I walk with Jesus that Jesus is saying, Daniel, I do not want you to be bitter. I, I want to make you better. And it doesn't mean that we pretend like these things don't happen and we don't have to deal with what happened, but we're not gonna hold things against people. Forever. We're not gonna give them a platform to hurt us again, but we are gonna walk in bitterness because that doesn't hurt them, that hurts us. And Jesus wants us to blossom. So let's blossom together and let's ask his spirit to root out that bitterness. God bless you.